So hello and a warm welcome to all of you worldwide. We're just waiting for the central characters to make their appearance and then we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Thanks for that Peter and may I say a big hello to everyone. England are in a 4-5-1 formation. Yeah, essentially this system lends itself to a more cautious approach, but that's not to say they can't turn caution into steady ambition. down to business here as they might they just couldn't get into an attacking area and now they can launch a counter steered out wide and he's got the ball through the cane oh good stop it had to be oh great save real class well you can't ask for much more than that a difficult moment he simply had to deal with attempt but not quite good enough England have grabbed this game by the scruff of the neck and aren't letting go Walker Oxlade Chamberlain Kane has it out wide and in space Oxlade Chamberlain it's Oxlade Chamberlain oh the keeper's done ever so well the keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Stop. That wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade, and it's Rose Kane. Lovely feet. Kane missed by a fraction. It so nearly came off for him, but that's the motivation and enthusiasm he shows, and the quality he produces. Oxlade Chamberlain. Oxlade Chamberlain going full diving header. In he goes again. Goal! England! England take the lead. Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. Well, to his credit, he managed to ghost into space to, to finish things off, but the failure to spot him was, was ghastly defence. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Still a fragile lead though, they can't afford to sit on this. And the 
first 45 minutes are up. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. That gets things going for the second half. Goes long. He's got options out wide. The shot's on! It's brought and in again! Yeah, just thinking about the goalkeeper again, he really had to be at his best, didn't he? There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Sprayed out wide. So, Jim, what are you thinking? There are any flies! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. England haven't made a substitution yet. And scored near to half time to make it 1 0. Tries a look into shoot! Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Tries to lift. He'll have a dip. Walker goes looking. Here's a change that was in the offing. Last one allowed. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Well, Red, he sorted that out. Tries to dink it in. Timely intervention. Trying to get there. Humphrey's had a good look and given a corner. Deli Alley gets good distance on it. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation. But it needs to be any time now, really. Slade Chamberlain. England can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. It really is now or never. They need a goal, however it comes. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. England, hold on. It's a narrow squeak. Bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. And there's a lot more to read into this game than just the scoreline. Well, thanks for your company, Jim, and a very good day to you.